We have been a bit quiet lately because for the last few months we have been doing a lot of planning. First, we have been preparing for Whitney's wedding which just occurred this last Saturday and it was an amazing day on a farm near Willows, California. Yes, that is a cow right behind the bride. We have also been planning and packing for our next road trip for 2018 and man are we stoked. Whitney's new husband Ken just recently acquired our 2011 F-150 from us and I got a brand spanking new 2018 F-150 Toe Beast in time for this trip. So where are we going? Thomas, Jesse, and Amy and I are heading to the Super Boats Factory in Maryville, Tennessee to pick up this boat. I think you've seen it. We have never had so much anticipation for a boat like this one and we can't wait to get back on it and this time really break it in doing some amazing wake surfing. From the factory, we are heading a bit northeast to our favorite lake away from home, Lake Norris, Tennessee. We have rented a house on the lake that sleeps 12 people with its own private dock. I am so stoked. Guess who's joining us? Ken took to wake surfing like nobody's business and he and Whitney love to do acrobatics on the longboard. This is some video from last August on Lake Shasta. We are bringing that longboard and they are going to spend a few days with us on Lake Norris next week. And guess who else is joining us? RJ and Emmy are also going to be with us next week and all of us will be wake surfing our brains out on the same beautiful 2018 Supra SL 550 on Lake Norris. Where do we go from there? Well, we have planned and booked a loop around the south visiting seven more lakes in as many states. First, we will be visiting Lake Cumberland in Kentucky on 511. Then to Cave Run Lake, also in Kentucky, on 512. We will be at Somerville Lake in West Virginia on 513, and then to Smith Mountain Lake in Virginia on 514. On 515, we will spend the afternoon on Lake Norman in North Carolina, then to the border of South Carolina and Georgia for an afternoon on Lake Hartwell on 516. Then off to Alabama for an afternoon on Weiss Lake. From there, we head to Dallas to take some of our extended family wake surfing for two days. Most likely Likely we will stop on the way out for a ribeye at Sweetie Pies in Decatur, Texas and then we drag our sorry tired butts home. This is an epic journey and believe it or not all of these lakes from Norris to Weiss are only three hours apart. We plan to spend all afternoon on each lake until sunset and if you are in any of these areas we would love to meet you, surf with you, maybe stop at your favorite barbecue joint, whatever. Just message us on Facebook or email us at support at wake9.com so we can arrange and plan for it. We are so stoked for this new boat, the new truck, and then putting them through the paces around the south to seven lakes we have never been to before. Please tell us the best places to surf, eat, etc. We can't wait. We will be posting on social media throughout the entire trip and plan on taking lots of video just like you knew we would. Please wish us safe travels and I hope we get a chance to meet some of you.